All right, I'm just going over another uh, Wulu product that I got. This is their wireless home intercom system. The model is WL-666. Um, I got it in black and I got a two pack. I actually got this for full disclosure. They sent it to me as a gift because they saw the first video I did on these units right here, their doorbell intercom system. So they figured they'd give me these to, uh, to try as well. I'm pretty happy with them. Uh, the, these are a great option if you have like multiple, say multiple buildings on your property or just to put them in like common places. Like right now we have one of these in the kitchen and uh, one of them in the office, um, but you can put them in other rooms. And then in the future, we're gonna put one of these in our in-laws house that's on the property. So instead of having to use the phone to call them. And the one thing that's great is they are compatible with these as long as you set everything properly. Inside the owner's manual, this comes with it by the way, a little quick start guide explaining everything. The owner's manual is more in depth. Here's all your different frequencies in the codes for talking on these different channels. There's different uh, codes. I'm not gonna get too in depth in this video about it, but say for example, you have this set on A in channel one you like to use and you're hearing somebody else's radio traffic or something, or you have so many of these in a building, you can change that to B, and then it will block out the others and they won't hear you, which is great. Uh, it's nice and clear. Um, these are your different channels to pick the numbers, volume up and down. Pretty obvious. Uh, you can't see it well in the camera, but this remains illuminated green for talk, and then whatever channel you pick, it's illuminated blue. Okay, so the monitor feature, you can set the unit to a channel and you'll hit the monitor button. I'm not gonna do it yet. And what that basically does is it lasts quite a long time. I think it's like 10 hours. I don't remember from the instruction booklet, but it will basically make this transmitting the whole time. So you could use it like a baby monitor. And let's use that for an example. Say you have one of these intercoms that you're gonna put in your baby's room. You can use it as a monitor to hear them by just hitting the button when you put them in there and say, like we always use channel one because we're just a household. Say you can set it to channel two, hit monitor. And then when you go to your other units, you can switch to channel two and it will continuously listen. And then if you need to talk to somebody else, go to whatever other channel they are and talk to them. So I'm gonna leave it on channel one to show you an example. I have it on monitor now, so I'm gonna go out to one of the handheld units and I'm gonna turn my TV on in here so you'll be, hear the TV as if it was monitoring this entire room. All right, so you can hear the TV in the garage over there. Now keep in mind that this channel is gonna be completely blocked. Nobody else is gonna be able to talk on it while that's going. So you wanna use it on a separate channel. And hit it again to turn it off. It's a neat little feature, uh, voice activated that's basically you can hit this button and when it senses you starting to talk it will start to transmit on the channel and then the call button is just a ring to all the people on that channel so say you have a different channel set for each room in your house and you wanted to call a specific room you know you can hit one and then hit call Hi, sweetheart. I just wanted to test the ringer option. Could you hear it loudly? Yes. Awesome. Thank you. You're welcome. You can see how that works. She's talking on one of those units over there. Almost forgot to put this in there. Uh, the, the group button. You hold the group button down and talk, and it talks to every single unit on the system regardless of channel or the code that's set up top here. I almost forgot to add that in the video. That's sort of like an override for if you have an emergency or somebody's set to the wrong channel. Uh, this group button will talk to any one of these on any channel that's within range. I mean, it's simple, it's light, doesn't take up a lot of space, uh, it has good distance. I have about five acres on my uh, where I live this will transmit to the handheld units and the handheld units from the doorbell will talk to it back no problem very clear like the doorbell bell units as well with the information that's in the owner's manual on the frequencies you can program 
like a Baofeng radio, a ham radio to talk to these as well. I'm going to make a separate video on how to do that. It's powered by plugging into the wall and USB. So you can also say you have like US extra USB port on your computer to save room. You can just plug it in the back of your computer um, or a USB bank. Say you wanted to use this as like a base station if you were out camping or something like that. Uh, good idea, but yeah, it's a nice sturdy little unit. Uh, you can mount it on the wall. You know, if you wanted to mount it up on the wall like that, it's actually a pretty good idea. I've just been using it on my desk and I brought it out here just to do the review. But um, yeah, it's it's cool uh, for the price. I mean, my price was great, obviously. They sent it to me as a gift, but um, the more of them you buy, the cheaper they are. And if you wanted a simple solution, Henricom system in your house that having to run wires and take up a whole lot of space, this is an awesome option. And the fact that you can talk to the handheld units too, I think is great. You know, so say if somebody's out doing work in the property, you can buy these units without the doorbell ringer from Wulu as well, individually, and they'll be compatible with it too. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, if you found this, I do have the other video on the doorbell intercom, check that out. And then here in the near future, I'm gonna be posting the video on how to program a Baofeng radio on here. Thing, one, two, three. I have the Roger. <laughs> okay, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> but anyway, it's cool. Thanks for watching.